Here is an Admiral 20Y4E chassis from 1956. I have completely recapped it including the filter cans. New capacitors have been placed inside of the old filter cans. Also this chassis has needed some repairs since I have recapped it. The vertical linearity pot was open and it has been replaced. Also, the horizontal drive trimmer was causing insufficient drive to the horizontal output tube and it was glowing red and it burnt a couple of resistors on the bottom of the socket which have been replaced. Also, the vertical integrator was bad and it was causing uh, the vertical not to sink. The final problem was that the high voltage cup was cracked and since I have not been able to obtain a replacement the old one was ticking I have converted it to solid state rectifier and all the high voltage connections on the output of the rectifier are sealed from air I utilized the old high voltage cup and a washer a nylon washer I obtained from Lowe's to hold it in place. I'm hoping this will solve my uh, ticking problem and everything will work fine because everything was working fine before except for the ticking sound. Here is the front or hidden side of the Admiral 20Y4E chassis. Here you can see my new horizontal drive trimmer on the bottom of the chassis and also the new high voltage lead coming out of the rectifier and also I've insulated the old heater leads to the high voltage rectifier away from the high voltage and so they will not short together. Here are the old high voltage lead, high voltage rectifier tube and high voltage rectifier socket. The next video I will test this and see how it works. Here is the Admiral 20Y4E chassis in operation with the solid state rectifier modification. Solid state rectifier was removed from an old solid state color TV. I was worried about not having enough high voltage because it did come from a color TV, but I have plenty of brightness and it only blooms if I turn the brightness to the extreme. You also want In to fact, I have here. slightly more Red brightness than I did with the tube rectifier, which concerns me yeah. that I may These need to check the, the high voltage values. to make sure it is not excessive for the black and white tube. When first powered up, there was some crackling noises, but I believe it was static electricity building up in high voltage. There have been no noises, no, no more ticking, no sizzling, no hissing, no corona from the high voltage after an hour of operation. I mean, that's a home run for us. I'm actually impressed with Jared right now. He um, really after really measuring the high about. voltage, Thanks a lot. I appreciate it. between the couches and the jeans, I will put this TV together and let it play. I knew what I was doing. Because I, I think I it has finally been restored to full working order.